All right. So starting out, we did start out pretty close together. Um, let's see. I went straight off building, and it looks like. And then you were doing it also. Hmm. For some reason, your commander is not moving for me. He's just constructing a third mix. All right. I'm at. 29 seconds. I'm a little behind you. I'm going to go ahead and speed up faster through this. So, building, building. Oh, wow. Well, so, you know you can actually turn those metal extractors and sometimes they'll actually fit in. Oh. Wait, is it by holding the left click while you're positioning them? Yep. yep. So, I, I see you nice. built two metal extractors and one factory. So for standard build, what actually people do is three metal extractors and one energy plant, and that actually gives you positive, barely, but positive, and also with um, a factory. So it kind of helps you balance. Because it doesn't look like your commander is doing much um, oh, other than okay. building one or two power things here and there. So at 2 minutes and 18 seconds in, I've got 1, 2, 3, 3 metal extractors and 3 power generators, and you've got 2 metal extractors and 2 power generators. Is that correct? Um, what time is it? 2 minutes and 18 seconds? Yep, 2.18. Uh, yeah, only 2 pgens. Yep, so that's sort of what was one of the things that was hanging you. Because mm. I had... I was building a very economy so as you can see I, I just sent this little guy all the way over just to go ahead and start building a factory to take that mechs field because it's a nice dense pocket of mechs and pretty easy to capture yeah so as you can see he's just starts building blah 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 not really doing anything um, much and you're just starting to take I'm sending other ones around um, to other fields but, and you probably saw him. Yeah, and I re kind of remained stagnating in the state in one place. Yeah. I pulled him back. See, you could have expanded way out to the farther edges um, and grabbed so much more. But you sort of remain stationary while I'm just continuously expanding. And if you look at my build patterns for things, if you hold down shift, I just sort of do a wave pattern for my power generators. Just sort of a squiggly line. Yeah, I see them. <laughs> yep, help save space, and also if you just send your commander off on doing it, it gives him a task to do, and it helps you build up your economy. Mm. Anyway, so as soon as I recognize where you are, I pull back, build up, start building defenses to fight you off with and then start building a line um, of factories behind that. And what you missed out was actually, uh, if I would taken more time, to the west, I was actually building a bunch of bot factories. To the west... Of your base. Of your base. Yeah, I, oh yeah. I, oh, that's the first one I noticed, the one that I destroyed. It, well, it wasn't that one, it's, it's much farther west. Um, I started building all of these bot factories. And... West, west... Oh, I see it. Yep. yep. So I, I started building there, so I would have been flanking you from one side. Uh, now, I did see your guys trying to flank along my back, which is why I p tossed up that uh, turret there, which killed off. I was going to start tossing up more turrets. Your tanks, your ants might have gone through, but I started building some doxes in my base, and by then, you were already gone. Mm. So at its pinnacle, your base had 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 11 power generators, and 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 11 maxes. And you could have gone southwards and grabbed all of the max behind, and also eastwards and grabbed a bunch of max. So one of the important things is that you just want to continuously be building engineers 
and then using them to expand your base. And you also want to stay away from uh, fabrication aircraft because they're actually the least in they're the least efficient ones.